Okay folks, rough start to Christmas for the eastern part of the world. We had some church bombings in Nigeria, some strong seismicity near the uh, volcano that erupted in Yemen a few days ago. We're having some pretty giant waves, some little mini tsunamis pound Thailand. And in Australia, some lemon-sized hail and mini tornadoes is going along with that severe uh, thunderstorm event that they have going on in southern Australia. We had five coronal mass ejections come off the sun in the last 24 hours, and the last two are coming at Earth. Now, as we set it in motion, you can watch the five uh, ejections uh, here coming off, uh, the first three off the sides, and then the last two coming at Earth. Now, we're going to look at each one individually here. This is the magnetic filament that lifted off the northeastern limb, and this is the coronal mass ejection we showed you yesterday coming off the southeastern limb, and that's in the 304 angstrom. This is the coronal mass ejection that comes off the northwestern limb, the magnetic filament that lifts off in an earth-facing position, and finally the earth-directed coronal mass ejection. Now while the Soho Lasco uh, isn't really showing uh, very much, we can assume that both of these are earth-directed, especially the second one just from the look at it. But here's that first one, that magnetic filament that looked like it was going straight up. You can see it's coming to the side. We can expect both those last coronal mass ejections to impact Earth's magnetosphere. Right now the solar wind, uh, the speed isn't doing too much uh, interesting, but the solar wind density is very, very high, uh, higher than we would expect ambient space weather. And now we've yet to see any horizontal disturbance in our outer magnetic laters here on the uh, flux gate magnetometer. Uh, but if this continues, we might have to worry about some geomagnetic instability right about the time that those coronal mass ejections hit. Folks, we pointed out this solar active region, it did pop off one of the coronal mass ejections. As you can see in the last 24 hours, it has decayed fairly rapidly in terms of sunspot, but it is fairly magnetically complex as well. Folks, last but not least, the GOES X-ray flux has come up off the floor, and we got to watch out for this as the day goes on. Might have some M or even X flares. Be safe, everyone.